Um, well, my name's Mandy Yo. I'm the community manager for Spot Hero. Um, as in all startups, we all wear a lot of hats, so I too wear a lot of hats. Um, however, my main goal is to um, communicate with our customers. So I handle all of the customer engagement, um, a lot of the client relations. Uh, I do the public relations. Um, and I also help out with operations. So it's fun, though. I love it. Um, so Spot Hero, what are we? Um, we are a web and mobile-based parking reservation company. Um, we have two, um, you know, the two platforms on the Android and the iPhone where you can reserve parking beforehand at a discounted rate. Um, also, we can do it on the handy-dandy computer. That works just as well. Um, we launched in 2011 in July. Um, so we've been around for a couple years, so really trying to get our start going. Um, we are headquartered out of Chicago here, uh, but we have been able uh, to expand out. Um, so right now we are currently serving Parkers in Milwaukee um, and also our newest one, which is D.C. So yay, we're really excited about that. Um, right now we have about 150 locations here in Chicago. Uh, we have about 20 in uh, Milwaukee and about 40 in D.C. Um, something else along the way, uh, you know, when we started out, my two uh, co-founders, um, actually there's three of them, I guess I, we always uh, forget about the Californian out there, he's uh, our CTO, um, but he's also a co-founder, uh, and then the two co-founders here are Mark and Jeremy, uh, you know, and those three really bootstrapped this company from the beginning, um, and then we were chosen to be a part of Accelerate Labs, which is an accelerator here in Chicago. Um, they do an excellent job uh, getting the startups in Chicago out there, gaining visibility, um, and really just kind of polishing them as entrepreneurs. So um, with that experience, we've really been you know, very fortunate to expand our business and, and to really kind of fine tune what it is that we want to um, get out there as the service that we have. So um, that's my blabbering right now, I feel like. So um, that's kind of the gist of it, I guess. Um, kind of just a summary of where we've been. Definitely. Those are great questions because I think everyone, you know, kind of gets what we do for the customer. You know, easy, reserved, discounted. Um, now, as far as the garages go, um, they're considered kind of as, a, as our clients, I guess you could say. Mm -hmm. um, and basically how we decide what we do for the business is we want to help them maximize their sales. Um, so we really are trying to get them, you know, customers in there for the times that maybe they're not having as much traffic in there. Um, now, there's going to be some um, operators who don't necessarily need that. They're amazing. They're doing well. Um, but there are some who, who would like, you know, some more cars brought in, and, and that's what we are here to do. Um, so basically how we design who we will and, and, you know, who needs our help is based on those types of things. Um, we do a lot of research, though, depending on, you know, is that area going to work? We, we work with the garage managers. We, we do the research together. Um, it's a very tight-knit partnership that we have um, just because we want to make sure that we're, we're doing everything together. Um, another thing that we do uh, for them is we offer this service and hope to maximize their sales, um, but we also do a lot of the work so they're not feeling overwhelmed with, you know, bringing on customers and things like that and having to worry about, you know, another another thing that they worry about because they have a, their plates full as well. Um, so we do a lot of the customer tracking. Um, we have our own accounting system that we, you know, take into consideration, um, which we run by them. We do on a monthly process. Um, you know, we, we um, work with all different types of companies, large scale and small scale. Um, you know, because there are going to be different needs for different types of companies. Um, let's see. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much how we track it. We really do a lot of it manually. Um, so, you know, we really have an understanding of how it works. And, and every single person on our team 
takes the time to make sure that they know that. So, um, you know, if a garage manager is concerned about something or, or they need information, they have about four different contacts, you know, per person, so they can always reach us no matter what. Um, you know, that's really important for us, you know, that we have open engagement with our customers, but it's very important that we have that with the garage managers as well. Um, just because, you know, they want to know that the customers are having a good, you know, experience as well. So we really try to make it, um, we're kind of like the middleman, but we try to make it as, as solid and as one as we possibly can. So we don't do any street parking, which is pretty much where city authority lies. Um, so we just work with the parking companies. Um, you know, we work with some pretty big names, uh, but again, we do work with those smaller companies. That's something, um, you know, we, we cherish them just as much. Um, and I know that, you know, we really, really try to make it a type of relationship to where, you know, we can call them whenever we need something, where we become friends. You know, I've, I've met many of the managers we have, and, and they're awesome people, and I love talking to them. And, you can joke around with them and things like that, just like you would with customers. So um, we really try to make it, you know, it's a very serious environment. It's very, you know, business-like. But again, we do like to, we do like to have fun with them and, and, and make it a good time for everyone. Um, so city parking, we really, you know, we don't work with the cities or anything like that. <laughs> well, of course, some of it's confidential. Um, you know, however, uh, I think every entrepreneur says this, but we would like to take over the world. Um, it's just a joke between us entrepreneurs. But uh, definitely the expansion is something we have in mind. Um, from the very get-go, we definitely are, are, it was in our mind that we wanted to expand. However, we are not going to be, you know, we want to do it slowly. We want to we wanna start at a place, make sure it's solid, make sure it works well, um, make sure people are happy, and then we're going to move. Um, you know, so we've been around in Chicago for quite some time. Milwaukee was our close neighbor. Um, you know, we had connections there. And then, you know, so D.C. is pretty big for us. So um, doing all of that and, and kind of getting acclimated with the city in general because their street names are totally different than here in Chicago, um, we really want to get that down, want to kind of fine-tune that, make sure that it, that it feels good there. Um, and then, you know, we're kind of off. I guess um, in a, an expansion sense, there's not any necessarily not necessarily any place we aren't looking at. Mm -hmm. um, so definitely, you know, if the need is there, then the need, then you know, we will go and we will do what we need to do. Definitely, um, yeah. So Accelerate is a company. Um, it's actually they just um, kind of changed the name. It's actually going to be TechStar Chicago. Um, which tech stars are around in the U.S. Um, I'm not sure if you're familiar with them as much. Um, I figured you guys probably were. Um, but yeah, so now it's Tech Star Chicago. But with an Accelerate, um, it was an amazing experience. I mean, you can't really, you know, say anything bad about it. It it was much needed. I would recommend it for absolutely anybody. Um, and you know, the two co-founders, they were pretty much the, the they're spearheading everything. Um, so you come in, you're actually chosen. There are hundreds of people that apply for this program, um, and they take you know the really top percentage of that, and they only accept ten companies, and it's per summer. So there's been three summers that they've done this and taken um, ten companies in. Um, so you get chosen to do this, and basically it's a really extensive, um, intensive mentoring program. Uh, pretty much. And what they do is they invite in uh, amazing entrepreneurs to come in and really, like I said, help fine tune the new, you know, the kind of green ones in here, uh, the 10 companies. Um, and it is just meeting after meeting after meeting, whether it's, um, you know, sharpening your skills at giving your pitch, whether it's changing and, and doing a pivot in your plan, um, you know, fine tuning that business model, whatever it may be. Um, you know, they really put you together with those people to where you are with them every single day for three months. Um, so not only are you really forming this new ideal and maybe, you know, getting your brand really put together, you create these friendships and these connections that are just, you know, unreal. So 
it's just kind of flattering that these people, you know, who have created these, you know, amazing companies come in here and they take the time to do this. So it's a great, it's a great opportunity. I would, like I said, I would recommend it to anybody, um, you know, and, and then you do the three months of the mentoring program. Uh, then you have a day where you, where you give your pitch. Um, and I believe there's like, I think 500 investors there that get to actually see this. Um, to So it's really kind of, it's, you know, go big or go home. Um, so I know for us, you know, it's, it's really helped in, in our success. Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't think we would be where we are if we didn't have the help of Accelerate, um, Techstar Chicago now. Um, so, you know, and now we're, we're still here. We're actually still in the Accelerate space and the other companies are here and, and, um, you know, we, we still get to see those entrepreneurs that come in. Now they're our friends. They say hi to us and, it's a it's a it's a really genuine experience, and I would definitely I mean it's amazing. So I, I can't say enough good things about it. Obviously. Yeah. Um, I mean it's it's a lot of stay tuned. I feel like I'm always saying that to people. <laughs> um, but just stay tuned. I mean we have a, a lot of big things in mind, and and you know basically we just we want to bring a better parking experience to everyone the, the operators the customers to everyone so um i guess stay tuned i guess is all i got for you